Hello ladies and gentlemen, Hollowtide here. Back with another Halo video to discuss something that I think is going to be a huge, huge net plus to the Halo community and will, again, help 343 kind of navigate expectations for the next year or so. We've been hearing a lot that campaign DLC isn't really on the menu in the near future. We're getting these seasonal stories. Hopefully that, you know, they'll be a little bit better starting in season three. But there is one thing that I think that can greatly help the Halo ecosystem. But before we hop into that, I just want to say again, like 96% of you aren't sub to the channel, but you watch the videos. What are you doing? Just, just go ahead and sub. I could be legitimately your third favorite Halo YouTuber. And we're so close to 11k. If we hit that before the end of the year, I'll go ahead and do another giveaway of Halo Infinite credits. So go ahead, go, go, go hit that sub button. Anyways, let's get into the video. The thing that I think will have a huge boon to Halo Infinite's ecosystem is the campaign AI in Ford. Joe Staten tweeted uh, a long time ago, I think it was in November now, hashtag Halo Hopium on a article from Halo Waypoint on if it was possible to add campaign AI into Forge, are you guys working on it? And they said it is possible and we're working on how to best bring those features from our internal tools into Forge at a later date. We see a lot of potential in allowing players to create experiences that lean into cooperative PvE space. Good news is with the addition of nav mesh and the support of AI controlled bots, we've already got a head start on pushing further into this area. They're not announcing anything today, blah, 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 blah. So Halo Infinite, and this is my personal opinion, and I've said this before a lot in previous videos, but Halo Infinite desperately, desperately, desperately needs some type of PvE replayability, and it needs to be, I guess, an aside from the campaign where people can just load in. Firefight is a great example where people just load in and kill bots, you know, AI, because sometimes you just don't want to go into multiplayer Sometimes you just want to hang out, you know, shoot some things. I think that there's a huge opportunity to kind of pick up where 343 has, you know, kind of dropped the ball. They've been focusing a lot on multiplayer. I think that that's important. I'm sure that they're working on campaign stuff, but obviously the timeline is a little bit further out. But if we could get something like Destiny 2 where there are strikes, you know, maybe a raid, how insane would that be? Those are things that I've wanted to see in Halo forever. Just you and two other Spartans dropping in on the ring or in New Mombasa or Reach or so, I don't know. You could recreate moments in time where your, your team of three is doing a strike on Reach, you know, while Noble Six is giving Cortana to Captain Keys. I don't know. I just want to see some stuff, you know? And obviously, what I think could happen is if they can add in multiplayer maps into a playlist for Forge, then I think that we could obviously see some PvE playlists, you know, where they've curated the best of the best from the community, and they just let people go wild in there. And maybe that's how you can, you know, add more challenges in for people to unlock things. Maybe there's, you do a hundred of these forge strike missions, you get an emblem. There's so much opportunity and people will do those things if there's a good reward at the end of it. And maybe even have a, you know, taking uh, an idea from Destiny is if you kill the main boss at the end of the mission, you have a 5% chance to get a weapon coding, like, or a charm or anything. So basically, I want to know in the comments down below how important you think this is if you would play it or not i know some of you probably don't even care you're only multiplayer focused people and that's fine i i completely respect that but i think that there's a huge part of the fan base a huge part of a potential audience that would be playing this game if there was some type of pve replayability i think people expect a lot more from games now and they want to see these full packages so Again, let me know in the comments down below. That's it for the video. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, and I'll catch you around the ring. Peace!